a standard reusable filter that can be used, cleaned, reused over and over. Hi, I'm Richard Hoyle. Um, I'm going to be telling you how to make coffee today. Um, somebody actually asked me to make this video. Coffee is one of my uh, favourite beverages. Um, today I'm going to be making coffee with the Avatza. Avatza Rosso, which is a very bold espresso. Very good stuff. It's available, you know, available in most big stores. Um, Go for the bats though. Personal favourite. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this coffee machine has many features. This is important. This is how much like the strength of how many cups you're making. As you can see this coffee maker is like pretty much like, loads of wear. Okay, so Pop the um, pop the filter compartment. I currently don't have any. Okay. So. Okay. So you'll need the filter, a measuring spoon, and of course the coffee. No. Um, holding the camera is kind of awkward, so I'll just explain to you what I'm doing. Basically, these spoons are pre uh, precision made. Um, they are. Um, it works out one spoon, like one heaped spoon of coffee per mug. Okay. So put that in the filter. I'm going to be making three cups. Kind of thirsty and could, could do with the buzz. Okay, so yeah. Okay. Put that in there. Now, make sure you get the right amount of water. Okay, now if you can't see that, that's like approximately, approximately like six, um, six little little mugs. Even though there's so big mugs there. Um, basically, this coffee maker is cool because um, I I drink big mugs. So yeah, two, one. Okay, so mount that on the machine. Now, because that says six, I'm gonna leave it at six. Pile that little baby on. Did you never give a damn in the first place? Maybe it's time you had the tables turned. Cause in the interest of all of all, they got the problem solved. And the friends is guilty. And the legal mates are way up here to try and stop cop and roll. You were dead from the get go, been my butter. To my gosh, that's the way you scared him. And now then you're dumb enough to thought all this is and never was. Don't measure me to piss and vinegar. Don't tell me you're slay. They got fear, you bullshit. Just another dumb one, trouble that fish did. There's another way to break through the noise.
Okay, and it's done. So, right, all you need is a little dash of milk. Okay, I am not going to show you. Samantha, I need to know. My software needs updating. How to make coffee in a cafeteria. Yes, yes, I'm slightly eccentric, but I know how to make a good coffee. I'll get you buzzed. Okay, now I'm going to tell you how to make coffee using your capital. Three scoops, one scoop for every cup. Don't use boiling water, use off the boil water or you'll kill some of the flavour. Fill the cafeteria in proportion to how many cups you're making. Like, don't fill it up if you're only making one cup. Okay, when you're done adding the water, stir it well. This mixes up all those granules and makes a better coffee. Give it at least two minutes before pushing the plunge down. Then wait an additional two minutes for it to set. Add the milk, pour the coffee. And enjoy.